a good point, safe. EBIS so 5 presentation. I would say that in today's environment, the number one reason why people are coming to America is because they feel safer here than anywhere else. So I'm assuming that you all represent some portion of your clients are foreign nationals, is that correct? Correct. Okay. So I've lived here for 40 years in Broward and it's been just a blessing to be here. And the EB-5 program was designed for high net worth individuals who are coming to the United States to invest, for sure, but also to create jobs for Americans. So primarily our market today are countries that are having problems with their own internal governments, like Venezuela, sometimes Colombia, Brazil, a lot of Brazilians these days. We have in our office, which has been which is just on the other side of the bridge here in Fort Lauderdale since 1979, we have six languages under roof, including Portuguese, Spanish, Hebrew, Mandarin, English, French, and we're just interviewing a Ukrainian and Russian-speaking paralegal to come and join us as well. So let me tell you about the EB-5 program. Has anybody heard about the EB-5 program? Yes. Yeah? Okay, good. Well, not too much. <laughs> Sorry, he's a student of the EB-5 program. So the EB-5 program has been around since 1990, and I've been involved in it since then as well because I thought it was a great tool for Congress to be able to establish. So they did set it up, and in the last four years, they've had extensions, six months, a little bit at a time, every time an extension to maintain it at the $500,000 level. So the individual must be able to demonstrate the $500,000 where it comes from and be able to include his entire family, including children who are under 21. So a few years ago, I started to look at the 100 Las Olas project and I want you to understand that we are a completely independent law firm. We do not represent the 100 Las Olas. We are not their lawyers. We do not handle any of their initial paperwork. We represent the investors. So any investors that we process through 100 Las Olas has been our clients. They chose on their own to select this as an EP5 project. Now there's a lot of reasons why they did that, but all you have to do is go outside. And I'm always amazed, you must be so thrilled to come every day to work and see another floor going up. <laughs> it's very exciting. Yeah, this is, this is, uh, this is very, very uh, amazing to be able to see this going up every day because it's a testament to the developer. And again, I'm not pitching the developer, but it's nice to see a developer who's putting in his own money and just waiting for the EB-5 capital to backload it. So it's a $206 million project, as you know. And the EB-5 that they're raising is 40 million. So it's a relatively small proportion of the overall capital. Are we going through the PowerPoint on this? Or yeah. Is there a clicker or something? Yeah. Okay. Great. So maybe you can bring this you up to me. Uh, okay, if it's not loaded, don't worry, don't worry about it. So, no, that's the video. Here, there it is. Right. Okay. So, I don't want to get too technical, but the job creation on this particular project has been very well done. And the most important and exciting news on this particular project is that there's been an exemplar that's been, that's been approved by the government. Is there, is there a, I don't even know if it's up here yet. I don't think it's no. up there. No, okay, no. so 